Hey everyone, welcome back to Rapid Piano. My name is Ronald and today we're going to be looking at how to play Steal My Girl by One Direction. Uh, it's a really nice song and it's very easy to play as well. So before we get started, let's see how it goes. So it goes like this. Alright guys, so there we have it. So that's the main riff of the song, which continues right along the whole song, except for the bridge. Uh, you know, the bridge is slightly a bit different than that. But other than that, this is your whole song basically. You just need to learn this and then you can play the whole song. Okay, so let's see how we do this. This is part one of the video, and if you want to part, uh, watch the full tutorial of the song, you can go onto my website, rapidpiano.com. Okay, so let's see how we get started. So your left hand is playing B flat on an octave. Okay, so now those of you who have small hands and who can't like reach both the B flats here, yeah, then it doesn't matter, you can just uh, play one B flat. Okay, but if you can, then it just makes it sound a bit more full and more better. Okay, so you can use both the B flat keys here. Yeah? And your right hand, this is the melody that you're going to be playing with your right hand. So it goes like this. This is the actual simple melody, let me play it for you. Okay, so that's the first line. Um, now, uh, for the note names, you can actually look at the piano on the top here and it'll show you the notes that I'm playing. So let me do that again. And again. All right, so that's the notes that we play. Now your left hand, let's do it together with the left hand, okay? So it goes like this. Okay, now I'm also using the sustain pedal as well, so it makes it sound more full, okay? And then the next part, you play it like this. Okay, so all this change there, now for the first part you are playing a, a B flat octave, so you are playing it like this. Now the second part, you just move your little finger back here to E flat, okay? So you're going to be playing E flat and B flat instead. So that's what your left hand is going to be doing. Okay, let's do that again. From the start, we'll start with the B flat octave. So one thing you'll notice is your right hand stays the same. The melody in the right hand is uh, is the same thing. It's just your left hand that changes from the B flat to the E flat and B flat. Okay. All right. Now, so that's the main simple melody. So once you get that, then you can do something like this, where you can keep playing more keys together in between. So let me show you what I mean. So you go like this. So all that we're doing there is, now you see when I'm playing my right hand, I always tend to keep both my fingers on this, uh, these two keys for the first part of it. Okay, so that's F and B flat. So let me uh, play the right hand alone with this and show you how it sounds. And then I move my thumb from the F, I move it up to G. OK, 
okay so all i'm doing is even though i'm playing the other keys here i'm always playing these couple of other keys as well together with those keys okay so it just gives it more of a full uh, sound okay and then your left hand you see what i do with my left hand let me play it slowly and then you can see what i do Okay, so what I did there is basically, uh, as I'm playing my left hand, instead of keeping my hand staying on, this, on those keys all the time, I just, you know, keep touching the second B flat key like that, you know, to add a bit more full sound in it. And then when I'm playing it like this, I do the same thing. So it just gives it more of a full sound. So let's do that again. And plus with your right hand, like I said, you hold on to these two keys and then for the second bit, you hold on to these two keys, even though you're playing the different notes here. Okay, so let's do that again. Alright guys, so that's the main riff of the song like I said. Uh, for part 2 of this tutorial, you can go onto my website rapidpiano.com. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. If you liked it, please make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. I'll be putting up uh, more and more piano tutorials like this every week. Thank you for watching.